Not traditionally considered a hockey hotbed, St. Cloud in recent years has become a household name in conjunction with our state's beloved sport. Thanks in large part to the St. Cloud State University Huskies. I think it's probably the deepest team that I can remember them having. Consistently ranked in the top five nationally all season long and leading the nation in goals scored, it's been no secret that SCSU is currently one of the premier programs in all of Division I men's college hockey. We knew starting the year that we had great leadership, that were really good hockey players uh, who cared about this program. When your best players are your best kids, you can do some good things, and that's exactly what we have. We've got a senior class that's had a tremendous amount of success in their career. And with the string of recent success for SCSU, naturally there has been a trickle-down effect on the area's youth hockey program. You know, there's been a big change. I mean, I, I moved here in 1976, and, and uh, one, there was only one sheet of ice here in town, and now if you look around, I mean, there's, you know, within 30, 35 miles of St. Cloud, you've seen a big expansion of youth hockey. And hockey's such an important part of our state. It's the fabric of our state and people will gravitate toward success. People will gravitate toward uh, exciting brand of hockey. The kids in the community look up to these college athletes as a source of inspiration. To go over and, and see a game at the National Hockey Center, that's their big time. And I think it gives them a lot of hope as to, you know, hey, this is something I can strive for, this is something I can shoot for, uh, because they see it up close and personal all the time. The logo that the youth hockey program has incorporated is very similar to, to St. Cloud State's. There's a real feeling of connection, I think, to the university because of that. A perfect example of local talent translating to the collegiate level is senior defenseman Ethan Prow. Now, many years after playing youth hockey in the area himself, Prow is a Hobie Baker Award finalist and has been a constant force patrolling the blue line for the Huskies. He grew up kind of idolizing the guys over at St. Cloud State. I know he went to a ton of games as a kid, and that's where he always wanted to play. Ever since I was probably four or five, it was kind of my goal and dream to play for St. Cloud State. Ethan has set the table for kids dreaming of becoming a future Husky. I think it's wonderful the success that Ethan is having, that he is a product of our youth system, and that he chose to play here, that he wanted to play here. And most important, he puts his whole heart and soul into this thing. He is a Husky, and he's a Husky for life. I think there's a great culture in our state through all, all corners, and we're, we're doing a great job to service Central Minnesota. And there's been kind of a pretty steady increase over the last four or five seasons in particular, and I think that's a great sign for what the future of not only the youth programs, but the high school programs. Uh, the more kids that are involved, the more kids have a shot at maybe getting to the Division I level at some point. Maybe one day that they can throw on the, the real uh, St. Cloud State jersey and play on the big sheet in front of a big crowd.